Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to import about 250 free materials texture just from Polyheaven into iPhone 7. And it can be applied in any of the 3D models in your iPhone 7 and Character Creator 3. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First, you can scroll down, go to my video description. I already give you the, the link at there, download 250 free texture materials from here. Once you click into this link, it will link you to polyheaven.com slash textures. And here you can see the total today is 248. It is about 250. All of these are materials. And now I will open my iCross 7. As there more, I will just create some of the props here. It can be some of the basic shapes. And where is the shapes? The 3D blocks here, I can apply some of it. Alright. So now I have some props here. And we are going to test on the material. Alright. So let's have a look at here. You can choose any of the material. For example, if I want the terrain, these are the terrain texture. You can see natural. Let's say if I want to have a natural, then I have to click on that. So let's have a look more. For example, the dirty, the road, the sand. It have some some of the materials like the wood. For example, if I want to apply the wood, this wood, what I need to do is just right click, open with a new tab. Now it open with a new tab here. Then I should download from, I should download in this way. I click download here. I choose 2K is enough as demo. I click download and now it is downloading as a zip file. Just need to wait for a while. Just a few seconds, it will done. Now I click here, this is a Google Chrome browser. I click here, show in folder. It will be inside my download folder. Roughwood 2K blend, I right click here, and then extract all and click extract. Now, open the texture folder. You see, it automatic extracted as a folder. Open the texture folder. You can see you have the displacement map, you have the roughness, you have the diffuse. And actually, not only all of this, here you can choose just a zip file. You don't want the blender. All right, the rest, you just pick the correct one or just use the PNG. It's okay. The rest, we all don't want. We just want the PNG. All right, GLTF, no need. Blender file, no need. We just want to have all of this map. And then we can just click download and again it download again just now it is selected in blender format we don't want that because now you want to have all of this all of these maps like the bomb like the displacement like the roughness like the specular so now it take a few seconds to download all right now it finished downloaded i click here show in folder again Let's have a check. Same as just now, you have to right click, extract all, and then click extract. Now you can see after you extracted the rough wood 2K under the texture, you have all of this map. Wow, that is really awesome. Now you can just back to your iPhone 7. Now, let's say this, this shape already selected. Click here. You can see all of this map. You can replace it. Let's say the bump. You can just replace it, replace the bump map. Okay, this is the normal. Alright, I import as the normal, I click OK. Now you can see immediately it take, take the effect of the normal map. Now, we already have this. Next is the base color. Let's check again here. 
the base color you have to, ch to choose okay, which one is the base color this is the rough this is the normal displacement diffuse so the base color you need to choose a diffuse drag in now it already have the diffuse next what else The bump you already put in, the roughness, this one. And here you have the displacement, you can drag in into here. Displacement, grayscale, click OK. Now you have the displacement. Next, again, the bump, the diffuse you already drag in, the rough. The roughness you can drag into here. Of course, the displacement, if you have the bump already, sometimes you, you can just skip the displacement, otherwise, it, it will have a little bit weird. Right now, let's say if you delete the bump, what will happen? If you delete the bump, it is perfectly smooth. So, you need the bump map to make it more realistic. Right, the, the bump map can be this one as well, the normal. Bump. Right now, it already have the bump. Okay, now we can have another test on on this one. Right, we can choose one more. Maybe we just want to have some indoor elements or the wall. Fabric. Let's say if you, you choose a fabric, for example, this is a zip. You click here, select the zip, and then you only choose all the PNG. Download again. It is totally the same, the same way you can apply. And here you, you just wait for a while. This is a second demo. Now it finished downloaded. I click here, show in folder. Same as just now. I right click there, extract all, extract. Once it extracted, same as just now, it is a texture folder. Now we try on all this jeans texture. For example, this one. I turn it, turn it here. Now it already have some bump, so we can change it. Just drag it. Drag the fabric bump. Then displacement, we don't need, we can just choose the diffuse, put it here. Then the roughness, we put it here. And then here you have the AO, drag in. Now everything completed, you can see this is the jeans texture. What about if we delete the bump? No, we lost the bump. So we better have, have all of these textures. Now it is really easy to apply all this texture. You can just download it from the poly heavens. Right, that's all for today about how to import 250 free materials from Polyhaven to iPhone 7.9 to apply in any to apply any texture on any 3D models in iPhone 7. Right, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all. So that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy. Happy animation and game developing. See you.